Beacon RV Park is usually a hot spot for summer travelers coming through St. Joseph. We have a lot of availability because uh, basically the normal uh, uh, tourism has almost stopped. Owner Glenn Gibson says the threat of flooding has kept people away. But interestingly enough, those rising waters are now creating new long term business for this RV park. A lot of people, you know, have them for that reason, you know, with uh, hurricanes or or uh, you know, bad weather, they can get out of the way. That's why Charlotte Chapman and her husband recently bought their RV. I don't have storage. I don't have a lot of room. We first met this pair two weeks ago when they moved everything out of their Lewis and Clark Village home. It's just south of the Rushville levee. If that levee gives, then it'll flood us that way. Then we have Short Creek, which is just south of us. Four other displaced families have set up camp at Beacon RV Park, too. Another four are expected soon. We are just having to bite the bullet. The Chapman's frustrations rising as fast as the river. If you had record snowfall and such, wouldn't that tell you to start dumping a little bit at a time? Water has already seeped over several feet on this wheelchair ramp. Residents say they're just waiting for more. In St. Joseph, Beth Vaughn, NBC Action News.